Hello, I'm Fast Lawyer with Oculus Rift Reviews, now with Windows Mixed Reality. Today we're going to do a Let's Play Initial Impressions Review for Dead Ground Arcade. This is a game just released on the Steam Store today, free to play, for every headset except the Valve Index. Now, I'm a Windows Mixed Reality, and uh, this game is very similar to Dead Ground Arena. That, that's the game that I bought and reviewed a while back. Uh, the difference between that and this game is really this is a 180 wave shooter only. Whereas Dead Ground Arena just had better mix of enemies. The weapon changes were better implemented. And so this is just strictly a 180 wave shooter. Now they're single player, but you can also do multiplayer. The, the bad thing about the single player... I actually beat this level and I thought it would unlock the next stage, but it didn't. So I don't know what's going on with that. Uh, maybe you have to beat it in multiplayer. The problem is, it's as you can see, it's searching, but there's no actual other persons online. I don't know if it works. There are some settings. Uh, graphically, it's just language. Uh, gameplay is just language, I'm sorry. Graphically, I, I just changed some of the post-processing shadow to high instead of ultra. It runs at 90 frames per second, just about. So, you know, right? What you can see, it's a little in the high 80s. Uh, that's all right. It runs smoothly for me. Not not the best graphics here. And sound. I'm going to leave the sound just exactly as it is on default. Basically, you just kill zombies. Pretty simple. You shoot the weapons or the health to get those. And let's go ahead and create a room. I, I want to, like I said, I already beat the first stage on single. And I beat the boss, and I thought I would unlock the next level. It didn't. So let's go ahead and try multiplayer. Maybe that'll make a difference. So let's create a room. Let's select a room name. King of Beginner. That's me. Let's select the first stage. And let's hopefully this unlocks the next stage. I don't want to make this video too long, however. So we're just going to do one attempt and see where that goes. Um, to be honest, I'm not a big fan of this game. Please keep your fingers crossed for me. Now, the voice acting is pretty bad, but the good news is that was the only voice acting that you'll get. So, yeah, it's pretty bad, but it's pretty short. And basically, you just shoot the zombies and get, collect the upgrades for both your hands. And so, to get the Uzi, now to get with the other hand. Now, I got two weapons here. Decide which zombies get priority. You get some cool weapons. Now the cool, the weird thing about Windows Mixed Reality, and I don't know if this is true for other headsets, but you're like floating above the air. I don't know if that's an error or if that's intentional. But you see, some of the weapons just aren't all that great. And some zombies will explode, whatnot. A lot of these weapons are only good, like, at short range, so you want to be careful. Honestly, just the normal fire, the normal weapons that shoot are the best ones. And like I said, I don't know, I don't know what's going on. Why am I floating above the air? I have no idea. Is it a bug? Is it a feature? I don't know.
So the problem with getting these special weapons is changing the weapon once you got it. Especially because of their short range, it's just hard to get a new weapon after you've gotten one of these weapons. Obviously, they're... So our mission failed. It, I think this game might be harder in multiplayer because every time I played it in single player, I managed to get passed around. But when I choose multiplayer, seems like I don't. I don't know. Maybe it's just bad luck. Anyways, this is Dead Ground Arcade. Uh, I'm not really a fan of it. If it wasn't free, I wouldn't even give it a 5 out of 10. I'd give it a negative recommendation. Even if they charge for 99 cents, I'd be giving this a negative recommendation. But because it's free, I'm going to be generous. I'm going to give it a 5 out of 10. It's a 180 wave shooter. It's just not well done. Uh, just The AI is dumb. The Although there's a variety of enemies, they just come by so quickly that it doesn't really matter. And although there's different types of weapons and that's cool, the zombies come so fast that if you get a, a weapon that's different that can uh, hit zombies from a distance you're always going to be at a disadvantage, especially since you have to shoot at a distance to get some of those other new we new weapons and not get stuck with the pistols. Uh, anyways, I'm Fast Lawyer, I'm with Oculus Rift Reviews. I'm going to put a link on my video where you can download this game. But like I said, if you're a VR veteran, you probably don't want to waste your time with this game. I'm Fast Lawyer, I'm with Oculus Rift Reviews. Thanks for watching, have a wonderful day. Goodbye.